new tonight. It eventually happens to just about everybody as we get a little bit older. It gets a little bit harder to see things. You have to use these. Reading <laughs> glasses becomes a necessary crutch. But now there's a new option. CBS 4's Lauren Pastrana takes a closer look at a recently approved procedure that could help you ditch your lenses. The bottom lens will allow you to read. Dr. Ernest Cornmel has spent a good portion of his career explaining why most of us end up needing help seeing fine print. I've been in practice for 30 years and we keep hearing this. When are you going to come up with something whereby we can read without our reading glasses? It's here. This tiny eye implant is called camera and was recently approved by the FDA. The disc is placed over the cornea in one eye, controlling the amount of light that's let in. Dr. Cornmel is one of just 30 doctors in the country who will be performing this procedure. It works regarding the pinhole effect, meaning the larger the aperture or opening, the more blurred the images will be. So this provides a very small opening whereby patients can read well without their glasses. I haven't been able to see the date on my watch for a long time. And I looked at my watch and I'm like, oh, the, I can see the date. I'm gonna aim for 15 reps. Diane Udalowis is an athletic trainer who started having trouble reading her client's charts a few years ago. She was eager to try a more permanent solution for her vision problems. You can see the camera implant sitting on her eye if you look closely. It's a painless procedure. Um, as the next day I could do anything I wanted. It doesn't affect my distance vision. Dr. Coleman Kraft was one of the surgeons who participated in the FDA trials. Clearly this is going to be a nice alternative for a large potential population of people. The youngest group of baby boomers, they just turned 50 in 2014, so there's a big need for this. Here's a bonus. If camera doesn't meet a patient's expectations, it can easily be removed. And um, the effects are basically reversed. Ideal patients are between 45 and 60 years old and have relatively good distance vision. The inlay may cause or worsen dry eye and other vision related problems. The procedure is not covered by insurance, however, and costs about $5,000. Lauren Pastrana, CBS 4 News, tonight.